showing some fun and easy canvas art. I'm not an artist, I can't paint things very good, but I saw this cute idea and I'm going to show you guys how to do it. Okay, so the things you're going to need for this project is a canvas. And I just buy the cheap ones because we're just gonna cover those up. And then I just cut up a bunch of magazines. So just any colors you like or any designs you like. Unfortunately, you're gonna cover a lot of those up, but if you wanna just get any colors that you might wanna see pop through. Some Mod Podge. That's what we're going to use to stick the papers to the canvas. And of course a sponge brush to apply that. And some paint, just any color you want. Okay, so let's get started. And what you're going to do to, uh, to put the papers on is just put the Mod Podge down first. And I like to work in smaller sections so that it doesn't dry out. And I put some on the front and on the sides because I like to kind of overlap the paper. Just take your paper. And just try to push any of those bubbles out. It's okay if there is some because it's kind of fun to add texture and stuff when you paint it. You can kind of see the bubbles and the different layers of the paper. And just keep applying that. Okay, and just keep doing that until your whole canvas is completely covered. And you can just layer the paper so that it's all covered up. Okay, so when you're done, it should look something like this. And I made sure to kind of overlap that on top like I was talking about on the sides. And then there's two different ways that I like to finish this. And this one, I just added a decal that I found at Target. And I think this would be super cute in a little girl's bedroom or in a teenager's bedroom or even a college student. I think it would be fun to take that. And I like it too still. I'll probably hang this in the hall if I can fight Rayleigh for it. She really wants it. Okay, and so another thing you can do is trace out an image that you want. So if you want a certain image, it would be good to maybe get one off of the computer. Or if you go to a scrapbooking store, you can usually find decals or different things that you can print off. I just decided to do an umbrella with raindrops, and I just drew it on there. You can do that, and then you're just going to want to take your paint and just outline the image that you've traced on there. Okay, so once you have everything outlined in the color that you want, then you just go ahead and fill in all of this with that color. Just paint the whole canvas, just making sure to leave out the images that you want. And it usually takes two or three coats of paint. So just apply one coat and let it dry and then just keep applying. Okay, so with the decals, you can just put it on like this. Um, one thought that I did have was I could put the decal on and then paint over it and then just peel the sticker off once the paint had dried. And I did try doing that, and I just wanted you to see that sometimes when you have an idea, it doesn't turn out as good as you think it's going to. But the good news is, is Braylee still loves this, and we probably will put this in her room, um, maybe fix it up a little bit, add some jewels or something. Okay, I hope you guys liked this. Let me know if you made some yourself. I hope that it's a fun way that you guys can create something new and fun to bring to your home. Let me know if you try it, and I will see you next week. Thank you.